I am gay. Suck my fucking dick. No, we're already going. Oh, nice. Um, <clears throat> <laughs> how embarrassing that would be if like other people had that tick, but they were on like NPR. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like I'm David Bean Cooley, and I mm-hmm. suck my father's penis. I, my my dad is black, and his dick is too big for my <laughs> pussy. Oh, uh, I'm Terry Gross. <laughs> <laughs> my black dad's big black penis is fucking me. Oh, uh, uh, anyways, where were we? Uh, Adnan is... Uh, I just, I love him so much. He's so charming to me. I'm fucking queer. I can't wait to suck a cock. I fucking love sucking cock. We're back on cock talk. Cock talk. <laughs> cock yeah, talk. I knew we were recording. Cock talk. I'm going in a new direction here. The gay direction. A direction, a queer direction. You're on uh, queer talk. Shouts out to the fucking car talk, man. Yeah. One of my going? most cherished memories randomly of my childhood is yeah. blasting car talk, going to Einstein Brothers Bagels, and hitting Marshalls with my mom for the husky section, baby. Yeah, dude. I was just in Marshalls suit. yesterday. Marshalls is hilarious. I fucking love. They don't Marshalls. have cell phone service in Marshalls, so you can't check to make sure you're not buying like. Oh know, really? A Chinese deal. knockoffs. Yeah. Because yeah. I was getting a comforter, and they had. I don't, I don't know if that's all Marshalls, but <laughs> yeah, you just no, went to a basement. Yeah, yeah. That's conspiracy. Uh, that's how the Nordstrom Rack is in on 14th. Yeah, yeah. So I went to Marshalls. I was trying to get a comforter because at Macy's they got those hotel collection comforters mm-hmm. <laughs> that cost like fucking nine hundred dollars or whatever. So you know they got to be good. That's what makes something good is oh, it yeah. costs too much money. Yeah. And so, but if you go to Marshalls, you can get that same comforter for like thirty bucks. Hell yeah. The hotel collection shit. So, but it's just the name, and then the inside's filled with like you know Chinese people's hair. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> and then the thread count might yeah. be different. <laughs> no, it's when we say down alternative, we mean an alternative to Down syndrome yeah. hair, <laughs> yeah. which we also sell. Man, is it? Do you do that often with your breast? No, I just was kind of getting a mo- uh, raising my arm, and it just felt like. You know, <laughs> had to fucking had to shake it out a little so bit. So for the audience, stop is shirtless. Well, right Nick now was shirtless. And he said we're going to shirtless. No, I podcast. changed shirts. I and put on a I more thought, comfortable fuck shirt. Fuck it, I'm not going to let my boy be the only one shirtless. I'll, now I'll you're the only one shit. shirtless. And now I'm over here bearing this cross. It's not fair. That's it's crazy, dude. Titties. Your 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 midsection looks like those stacks of proofing dough. Mm-hmm. At uh, Domino's uh-huh. Shout Good out to shit. anybody that's ever worked in a pizza restaurant. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, those big blue. Trays filled with yeah, it's delicious. I know what you're expanding dough. My body looks delicious. Like no, dough. no, it looks like it Tasty, looks like, like a, a minimum treat. wage prison. A treat that An women icy minimum put wage mouths. prison. A fucking walk-in freezer. They want to kiss it until they get down to the sausage. You know what I'm saying? No, kiss kiss my my stomach until you get down to my cock. Yeah, that's what I meant by sausage. I don't thought you, you mean, could probably put that together. Un- under to your cock? Huh? No, because it's under. No, your it is not under my stomach. That no. is a common misconception. Yeah. I'm not under the that. sea. Uh, I've had like an under the sea song, but it's under the sea section scar. <laughs> <laughs> and it's it's that lobster eating pussy. He's <laughs> like he loves he loves divorced women who got divorced because their husband couldn't handle their C section scars. Wouldn't you, Cheryl? It's your fault for having a, a not you. Your pussy was fucked up, and now you have this gross scar. And wouldn't I can't it be the fuck opposite? He didn't have pussy and. Fingering a butthole. No, dude. It's hard to make it straight. I was cesarean. It, yeah, that's you? because your dad's dick is so small. We already talked about this. <laughs> right. <laughs> I like I like that my brain can only work a, a certain back. way. <laughs> I know. I know. Yeah. Uh, uh, but wouldn't a guy uh, prefer a C-section? I think if you push his wife's if pussy, you, gets if you still push vaginal birth, your pussy gets wrecked if you're pushing hard. Mm-hmm. They tell so, you to push. But exactly. But what uh-huh. I'm saying is, what you need to do if you're smart, and you want to keep that yeah. pussy intact. You I'm, go straight I'm gonna for the be, C-section. I'm going to be such a feminist that I get a C-section for my wife. That's where they cut Hell my yeah. balls open and <laughs> and put the sperm in her pussy <laughs> <laughs> directly into her pussy. <laughs> so I don't get the. I don't even get to get you don't hard. Even get to come or <laughs> yeah. get hard. Wow. I don't come. I don't get hard. You and you're conscious the whole time. <laughs> you're screaming. They crack my nut like an egg. <laughs> <laughs> like a fucking sunny side egg. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just <laughs> the just drips. Ooh, uh, yeah, out. Yeah. We should go we, screaming. <laughs> yeah, I love yeah. you, honey. We should go with Sob. He to- will not divide us. <laughs> he will not divide us. Yo, by the way, someone I think actually Big Cat retweeted that fucking video of the lady screaming. The no! No! I, ju- I just watched that again last it's night. The funniest it's so video. Fucking it's great. It's the funniest video. Mm-hmm. And it's like I guess uh, it was just the anniversary of that yeah, video, right? It was mm-hmm. Trump's the inauguration. inauguration. Yeah. No! Yeah. No! 
<laughs> yeah, that happened on on Gay Twenty. Oh shit! That's what they uh, January twentieth. They call it Gay Twenty. They call it. It's zero. like four twenty, but for gay guys. Zero, nice, nice, zero nice. Gay Twenty. That's where you smoke another dude's. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh yeah, legalize gay sex. <laughs> <laughs> Gay sex should be legal. <laughs> yeah. Legalize sodomy. There's a guy named Blowjob Marley who's like, <laughs> does a lot of very, very gay music. <laughs> Checking He's on like, penis. <laughs> yeah. Lively up your ass. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, no. A power bottom soldier. <laughs> <laughs> no. Getting penis, fucked in my ass. I cry <laughs> because I want to suck it. Uh, it makes so, me fu- sad. I when fucked the sheriff. <laughs> Woke up this morning, and the uh, three little birds. No, Adam can't do it. Come on, yeah, you so, already so, oh, You're on, really yeah. bad at this. Come on, bro. You're so gay. <laughs> you probably <laughs> think this song is about you. You're so gay. <laughs> You're so gay. You know that you song probably? was written about you. Warren, I actually do. Warren 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 actually, it was written about you, Adam. Rosemary it, Clooney said in an interview recently that she wrote it about you. Really? I thought it was uh, what's not re- someone else. It's Rosemary Clooney. No, uh, George no, Clooney's mom. Uh, Carly Simon. No, no, that's "You're So Vain," you fucking idiot. That's a different song. Wait, I'm you talking were... about? I'm talking about "You're So Gay." <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. It's a song by Rosemary Clooney, oh, okay. and it's about you. And she said that in an interview. I'm, oh, I didn't know that was. I think a it was song. just. I would just think it's a parody of "You're So Vain" by Carly no. Simon. No. no, the Rosemary Clooney song came out first. Mm-hmm. "You're So Vain" came out afterwards. After so she show. was by doing Na- a parody. And it's by Nancy it was, Sinatra. It's not Nancy it's Sinatra. It's Nancy Sinatra. Yeah. And that's also this about you. This dick was made for sucking. And then, and then, <laughs> and then, Carly Simon covered <laughs> yeah. it, and then One her cover dicks. was about somebody else. But both, these you were so gay, and then the Nancy Sinatra, you're so vain, are about you. you. Yep. Oh, okay. That all checks. That's all true. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's... You're so gay. You're so gay. <laughs> you probably think this song is about you, but it's actually, but it's actually, it's about a guy named Adam Friedland. <laughs> He's the gay guy in the song. <laughs> we all know wow. that classic. Yep. That wow. classic. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'll uh, have to look it up on Spotify later. Is that George Clooney's mom? It's his aunt, I think. Oh shit! Okay. Really? Yeah. That's a real singer. And Nancy Rosemary Sinatra Clooney? has to be I think Frank's so. Yeah, daughter. she does. Uh, she does that. Uh, I, the only song of hers I know is that Mambo Italiano. I oh, saw her yeah. on a on a That's game a show one time. Uh. I was watching old game shows, and they're like, "Now let's meet the stars," and it's like Shirley Bottomsworth, you know. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. Michael uh, 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 Sanderson, and everyone's yep. like Michael Sanderson, you know. And it's like, <laughs> who the fuck are these people? <laughs> I guess these people that were like famous and like. Yeah. 1971 and no yeah, is that any. on the buzzer network yeah right an old mm-hmm. ugly yeah. skinny lady a gay guy yeah a guy that's gay that can't be so he's he, just game she's 70s game show yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah yeah he's just doing sassy Hello. looks yeah. <laughs> and they're like i wonder when he's gonna get married a fat guy sweating he's so charming <laughs> yeah, 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 i wonder yeah. when that man is going to settle <laughs> yeah. down and that man get like married catch. and Finally take off his extremely tight bow tie and expose his <laughs> frail, delicate body to his lovely, overweight wife. <laughs> his lovely, autistic, overweight wife. Damn, are you sad that you're gay now and you can't have a beard, Adam? From not, from, <clears throat> wait, you're saying that because I can't grow a beard? No, 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 I'm saying if you grew up in the 70s, you oh, can have a beard. Oh, a beard, like a gay beard. Yes. Yeah. Well, mm. I have one, Dasha. Yeah, but we all know. I mean, that's that's only a matter of time. Her career takes off. She leaves you. Of course. It's going to be great when Dasha starts fucking Brandon Wardell. <laughs> no. It's going to be someone else. Yeah, it's going to be Brandon Wardell. <laughs> no, it's no, going to be, gonna gonna be like a fucking strong version of Adam. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> it's be someone let's see who you got annoying. cucked by last time. <laughs> a private DJ lesson <laughs> consultant. <laughs> This time it's going to be the only person in the world worse at comedy than you. Oh, wow. Well, I appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I appreciate not, the not bottom. being the worst. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congrats, man. Um, that was so funny. We got to talk about you getting owned by that lady. When she said that uh, maybe you could tell some jokes next time. Yeah, yeah. Hilarious. So funny. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't watch it. Uh, because you shouldn't watch it. I'm pretty embarrassed by it, Yeah, to be yeah I actually yeah. canceled my subscription to uh, kike.tv yeah. <laughs> before you went on. <laughs> <laughs> I was uh, I, it was my favorite channel, yeah. and then I heard that they were having you on. <laughs> so on, on their panel show, Jew Eye. 
Yeah, Jew with Tom, for the gay Tom guy. Shul Jew. <laughs> <laughs> there were like some straight up like Nazis on the show before me though. Whoa, yeah. really? Yeah, there's this Did one guy that them? belongs to this uh political party in Israel called Yisrael Beitenu, which is like the Russian far right wing party. Nice. Yeah, yeah. They're like Wait, he's in Israel? They're like MAGA guys basically in but Israel. The, in Israel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I guess that is like where the most of them are, you know. If but I got booked by a cum boy. The guy, some guy yeah, that works yeah. there l- listens to Come Town. That's hilarious. And and <coughs> I guess he book me and Nick next, guys. We have some. You really guys should be on the Israel show. Yeah, dude. T- it does do they know that I'm a was a red eye regular? Yeah, a beloved yeah. member of of <laughs> of the delightful panel show Red Eye on Fox <laughs> News. <laughs> With uh, what's a, his name? A, presumably Shalou? a comedy yeah. show. Yeah, where you show up and then they just say things at you, and you're supposed to. I guess they don't be give funny. you the bits yeah. before. You're supposed to riff with they. Well, they tell you what the topics are at like 3 p.m. and then you show up at like six to tape it or whatever. Uh-huh. Um, and then they're like, "Yeah, write stuff for this." And it's like, "No, you no." You're paying me zero. You dollars. have writers, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, I, I also made zero dollars for my. Imp- Oh, my that's a sh- that's a real shock. Yeah, yeah. They're going on. Oh yeah, the snack nah, they had they had good ass cookies though in the green room. Oh there. yeah, the, the, did they? These, yeah, and you get to see Jews. like Bill O'Reilly, you know, storming around. That's and funny. Dobbs just pissed off about shit. Pissing his pants drunk. Yeah, and uh, 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 but they had you know the what are those little cookies were in the center? There's that like raspberry flavored like, yes. dot. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah of what course. Are, what are those called? They're, uh, I don't like, know what they're called, but they're I, I would never go. I would never go buy those. But absolutely you, not. It's just as a rare treat here. It's and a there. good. Yeah, listen, that's Aren't a good palate cleanser. Cookies? But I'm not. I don't really fuck with those, honestly. The little jam in the middle type shits. Yeah, I don't really fuck with those. They're uh, they're nice when you have a little cup of free cup of coffee. And you say, maybe I will have a cookie. <clears throat> My problem is they don't mesh well with most cookie flavors. You know what's bullshit? Macaroons. Mm-hmm. They're yeah. just shit cookies. Yeah, but they're, they're sort of the appetizer of the cookie world. Nah, you know what it is? It's, it's a fake mouth. business for rich women. I agree with That's that. That's where macaroons come yeah. from. Is some rich man's, uh, uh, like, daddy's girl who's in her late 30s is like, you know what? I'm going to do something with my mm-hmm. life. And then she starts a... Uh, Macaroon slash cat cafe. <laughs> well, I think it? the macaroon craze is over. I think that was a thing. It was supposed to be yeah. the new cupcake, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But listen, I don't fu- I, I'm not mad at macaroons. I would take a macaroon over those little raspberry cookies. You know what I'm saying? Those raspberry cookies, go those to any Christmas parties. Them, those shits are getting you know left. What my business is? Those are the last things to go. My rich man, my oatmeal, fake rich man business, oatmeal. edible Gundams. That's good. A That'd place where cool. you go in, you build your own fucking gingerbread gun. Very intricate gingerbread I Gundams. It. I love it. We're not talking some bullshit gingerbread man or gingerbread house. Like, Gears that work. Yeah. Uh, yes. 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 <laughs> yes. We're talking like you. You cannot walk in there and not have like extensive experience with oh, model fuck. building. What about what about like a, a gumball cannon? You shoot gumballs. That would be your cool. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't. I mean, I don't remember that in Evangelion. I don't think or that a web, happens. Or a whipped cream cannon. I don't remember that happening in the in the manga. So, but is that there's got to be one? That? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> what the not. fuck is Evangelion? <laughs> yeah, what is I, that? I just know that that's like a thing with Gundams in it. Oh, is it? it yeah, it's an anime that I think has, nice. I th- that might be the one that has. Okay, Gundam. no Gundam. Wasn't there something? Oh, yeah, right. Was it Gundam, called Gundam? Gundam Star Wars. Gundam Wars. Wing. Yeah, yeah. Gundam Wing. Gundam yeah. Wing. Yeah. Because yeah. I remember that I shit rocked. I don't. I, I never. I've never seen it. I just remember thinking it was so funny that it was so close to condom and being like, "Oh, that's how true. does nobody? Condom. It's just called condom." Yes. And everyone was like, "No, well, at least well, none of the people that were had sex they yeah, made yeah. Gundams, so they, yeah, they yeah, never, yeah. never. They're like, to "What's them. a condom? <laughs> right, right. Do you right. mean a Gundam? <laughs> well, yeah. They they're like, no, it's a, a thing that goes over your penis. And they're like, <laughs> yeah. no, it goes over your whole body. A Gundam. Yeah. Yeah. A, Gundam. a Gundam is a suit you wear to prevent you from having sex. <laughs> oh God, I had the. Yeah, no, you didn't have. I had it. You fucking seconds bitch! Ago. You don't yeah, understand how to build a bit up. <laughs> God damn it! I had that. I was just. This is why Brandon Wardell is gonna fuck your girlfriend. He's not gonna fuck my girlfriend. He's gonna roll in on a skateboard, being like, "Huh." I met Justin Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first of all, he cannot skate. Second of all, he drops in. She's moving to New York. Yeah, yeah. well, so it's so going to be someone get else. far away from Brandon Wardell. So who's it going to be then in New York? It'll be a New York fixture. Maybe Tim Dillon. <laughs> that would be funny. Yeah. His return to women. <laughs> he eats her pussy to taste your dick. Um. Yeah, that'd be funny. <laughs> <laughs> that being that gay, that you like pussy to taste dick. <laughs> I might go to Modell's today and get one of those... Uh, I've I've graduated past foam rolling to mm. those little massage balls, not yes. lacrosse. I know balls. what you're talking about. The, got, the little spikes. 
uh, they're a little bit bigger. They're like the size of those, uh, you know, like a kid's basketball, mm -hmm. like for, um, like for what children, for like super shot or whatever. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. A mini basketball. Mini basketball. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Like one of them, like a, a little what, bit bigger than a softball. One of those is Adam's dick, and a regular basketball is my dick. That's true. For the listeners, and my dick is uh, no, the fucking a moon. It's a, yeah, it's, it's a, the entire <laughs> earth. No, it's a, it's, it's a, <laughs> it's a koosh ball. Your dick is <laughs> fucked up, and it's like stringy. Yeah, it's much right. softer. That is my dick. It's easier to palm and dunk. <laughs> so, who's got a cooler dick? I do. Only black guys can size. palm yours. Yeah. With huge hands. That's right. Um, What's yeah, wrong with that? Are Stav's, you racist? Stav's dick is a basketball that deflates after 30 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, just chill. It'll, it'll reflate. Just let's It'll chill out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, oh, you want to go to the concession stand? <laughs> No, your basketball deflates, and then you just list everything you've eaten for the last forty-eight hours. Yeah, let's just. Yeah, sorry. I, I, yeah, I hit the nacho bar. I had a bar. Whoopie, pa uh, whoopie pie, bro. My dick is on the comeback swing. I'm a three day, three day straight no s uh, smoothies. Going to the damn gym. Okay, I'm eating clean. Yo, uh, uh, by the way, fuck New York Sports Club. Okay, why? Yeah, they're getting the, they're getting the official the anti come down. Fuck they didn't you. Didn't let you cancel. They, they, they're they shady motherfuckers, dude. Oh, yeah. They'll tell you you can cancel over the phone, and then they'll say you're canceled, and they'll continue to try and bill you. Whoa. And now they're calling me saying I owe money, and then they emailed me, and I emailed me back. I'm like, no, I want everything in writing, so tell me what I owe and itemize it, and they just won't respond to it. They're just going to call me so that they can bullshit over the right, phone. Right, mm -hmm. right, And they won't do... And in uh, the same company, like Town Sports International, they just got like a $20,000 fine from like Washington, like their Washington yeah, yeah, sports yeah, yeah, clubs yeah. doing the same thing where they tell you, oh yeah, you're canceled in person and then they don't cancel you and then continue to charge people wow. afterwards. I mean, like my card changed a couple months back and I didn't update it with them because they start they just raise my rates without notifying me either by phone or by email which are like my preferred contact yeah they're like oh we mailed something out i'm like yeah i didn't get it so Suck my nuts mail you know no one fucking checks the mail motherfucker yeah you yeah, know what yeah. you're doing um so <clears throat> i don't know yeah fuck that company fuck them. and then if like if they don't email me back i don't know what to do because they're gonna eventually send it to a collections right, agency right, and i'll right. just have to dispute it with them because damn that's fucking... if they can't provide a copy of my contract that or anything sucks that shows that i oh, right but yeah Damn, dude. No, it sucks because it's Shoot. like this is like I'm trying to get better credit, and so I have to jump through all these fucking bullshit ho hoops with secured credit cards, and then it's shit like this fucking gym, which I'd prefer to just not deal with. I of mean, course. fuck you. You want the money? Suck my dick. You Honestly, figure out a way to get it other and, than and I know this damaging sucks, my credit. But you might as well just pay them a couple months and then move on with your life. I don't. I don't want to pay them anything over I the know. phone. If they give me a list of things that I fucking owe, yeah, then fine. You, you I'll straight pay up. It, but I'm gonna have to go in person probably. And do what? They'll deny that I fucking went there in person. I don't like. I, well, I no, can't. It have, has to be in writing. I'm not doing right, anything. In person. They'll shit. give you. They'll give you something like that. You sign that says you're released from the contract. I I don't know that they'll do that. I that's, think they I do. Think that's I think that's what James do. Yeah. All right. Well. PF Planet Fitness. I, also, did that shit. also, I don't have a contract. I was oh. month to month, for like a year. Oh, interesting. Well, you need something, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear that. Me and the good folks who plan to finish the story, we haven't had any, any run-ins yet, you know? But if you want, I'll go fucking... <clears throat> I'll go shit in every New York sports club shower there is, man, for yeah, you. Yeah, definitely. Do you want me to do that? No, I mean, if this doesn't, like, resolve itself, then... Can I mean, ask? I've already done what I can, which is broadcast to... 80 million people yeah, that that's right They're a shady company That's right We got picked up practices. by Indian t The biggest channel in India Also by the way guys uh, Cometown Cometown did? Yeah that's how we get the 80 mil Whoa yeah. mm -hmm. We just signed distribution deals With India China Yeah uh, Antarctica You know what's funny is in Those Indian guys Would probably love or the Indian guys we do on the show. That's true. Yeah, they, they, would, would, they would be flattered yeah. They would be like I love Sundar so much So what is Is it really racist guys? Think no, about it that way it's no, Asians Asians love being racisted too. <laughs> Real Asians? No, yeah. I don't mean these American Asians. I don't, no, mean, I like those I don't even mean a, a guy named like Dan Wynn, you know, sure, who's sure. like, how dare you say that to me? Right, and it's like, right, all right, well, right, you don't have right. the voice, so right. I don't even consider you Asian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah what yeah. happened to that slam poet that was mad at you? <clears throat> Oh, yeah, that guy from Singapore. <laughs> that <laughs> slam poet from Singapore. Yeah, yeah, yeah a slam yeah, poet like from Singapore who was mad at me, but he lives in Singapore where they like, don't have freedom of speech. Right. So he's like, this guy should be in fucking jail. Right. And they were like, he should be executed by the state. And he's like, that's what you get for making fun of Chinese New Year. 
<laughs> uh, fuck. Didn't Chris Brown get arrested in Singapore? Did he? For some, yeah. Maybe um, for lewd. Maybe for lewd lyrics. You never know. Really? I don't know. I love that spitting there is illegal. Yeah. That's Swallowing it. only, bitch. Yeah. You better catch the whole nut. <laughs> <laughs> Them's the law. Drink, 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 drink the nut like it's uh, the the raw egg milkshake from Rocky, but not the first time. The last time where he can do it. What? Do you guys remember that? Where he, tr- yeah, yeah, yeah. He makes that raw egg milkshake immediately in drink, the movie. But he spits it out at first. No, he doesn't. Yeah. Huh. I don't the first remember time, that. That's the From beginning Rocky of the montage. One? And at the end of the montage, he gobbles it like girls should gobble our nuts. That's what I'm saying. I thought, what is he? He comes home. I, I thought that was part of the scene where it's like you, you're first meeting Rocky, and then he goes home to his shitty fucking apartment, mm-hmm. and then puts on that uh, that Glenn Fry song. Mm-hmm. Uh, which, the Heat Is On? No, nah, the one about the... Uh, it's like, is that Glenn Fry? I don't, I don't know. Maybe it isn't Glenn Fry. It's the heart of my penis. No, maybe it isn't Glenn Fry. It's like that, 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 like... Glenn Fry is from the Eagles, right? He is, yeah. Hey, how about Glenn Berger? Speaking of Rocky and speaking of the Eagles, did you guys see that guy drive a doom buggy buggy up the Rocky steps? (laughs) No, (laughs) that rules. Yo, Philly was going buck-ass wild. After they made the Super Bowl, some dude drove a fucking dune buggy (laughs) up the Rocky steps. You see the guy, they they had the, they greased up all the fucking light poles with Crisco. So no one could (laughs) climb them. So no one would fucking climb them. them. And then they figured out a way to do it (laughs) anyway. Of course they did, dude. Yeah, they also, uh, Philly also had a secret uh, Bill Cosby stand-up show. Oh, yeah, yeah. And, uh, did they? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Cosby did, did, show. did some time Legend. at a jazz show. Legend. Yeah, yeah. And, and yeah, Doctor, apparently it was Bill well Cosby. received. That's hilarious. And I sure, think the woke take comic. for 2018 was, did we jump the gun on accusing a black man of rape? Oh. Ooh. It comes back around. And I, also, a- ageist. Wait, how about this? Oh, so how about this, guys? Conspiracy theory. Cosby had grown tired. He reached the pinnacle of stand-up. Okay? Mm-hmm. So he leaks these stories. He mm-hmm. tells Hannibal to do this. Yes. He kn- so that now the only challenge is can I still kill when everyone in America hates me? So mm-hmm. now yes. it's I got, the only... You I, got know, he he it I got an idea easy. for a movie. He was killing too easy. Now everyone hates Every him. Every audience that saw him was like, oh, this is the most America's most beloved comic. Exactly. I'll laugh I got an idea says. for a movie. Let's is, hear it. Is, so it's, it's Bill Cosby now down and out in Philly doing these, these bullshit bar shows, you know? Yes. Mm-hmm. And he's killing, and people <clears throat> have forgotten who he is because of all of the assaults. And then Sandra Bullock... Who lives out in the suburbs with her millionaire husband <laughs> that owns a bunch of taco bells? <laughs> she adopts him, Whoa. and she brings him into her, her house, and oh, she's like, I wonder "We're how gonna, this ends. yeah, we're gonna make this guy the best comic in the world." <laughs> and then you know she's buying him pants or something, and somebody says something racist to him, and she has like a teary meltdown and mm-hmm. calls the police on the yep uh, the, the poor arrest. white woman that said something yeah. racist, <laughs> <laughs> and then they throw the poor white woman in jail, and then for some reason that's a three and a half hour long movie. <laughs> <laughs> and then the guy's not that good, it turns out anymore. Yeah, right. He only had a couple good seasons for the Ravines. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Michael Orr. Michael Orr, yeah. yeah. And then he couldn't play. I think he went to the Panthers or some shit. I don't know. I stopped watching football. That, I walked out of that movie. I can't believe the you went side? into it. Yeah. You went to the theaters In to Detroit, see In Detroit, yeah. Why? Were you killing time? Yeah, it was a 75 cent ticket. Hilarious. Yeah, I saw that in a movie called Frozen that was pretty good. The mo- <laughs> the no, no, no. Different one. <laughs> came out came out years prior. This was like eight, nine years ago. Okay. What was it about? Um, It's about three people. They go on a skiing trip. They uh they like bribe the chairlift guy to let them go up on the mountain one last time oh, right no. before the park closes. And then, uh, like, there's miscommunication. They get left halfway on, up the mountain on the chairlift. Oh, fuck. And uh, then there's, like, a storm coming in, so the park's going to be closed for a week. <gasps> so they're just stuck on the chairlift, no. and they have to decide. So the whole, the entire movie is just them on the chairlift. No! Whoa, scary. It's like that movie Open Water, it's but It's exactly skiing. like Open Whoa, Water. Whoa, what the yeah. fuck do they do? But no um, sharks. I Well, I if this were not recorded, I would just tell you, but I would encourage people to go watch that movie. I want to know, though. Um, uh, the smoke joint followed me on Instagram. Oh, nice! After I gave him that, I know shout what you're out. doing. I know you. I see what you're doing. You mentioned a barbecue restaurant to get me to forget that I want to know the end of that 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 movie. No, I was thinking about it. I, and it I forgot that people listen to this show. I just had a sudden moment of self awareness that. Oh, I see. Yeah. That this oh, so because the smoke joint followed you, that reminded you people listen, and you won't spoil the Frozen. Yeah. 
Okay. I, I don't care about you. I'll spoil it for you yeah, later. I want to. It wouldn't be a spoiler. I want to know. Yeah. It's not the same thing. Is that still a spoiler if you want to get spoiled? I don't think so. I think a spoiler has is malice. Spoiling behind it. it. Yeah. There's malice behind the act of spoiling. Why is a spoiler on a car called a spoiler? I never understood that. That's a good, yeah, that's me a good neither. Question. Is that is that related to some kind of fluid dynamics term? Yes. Spoiling. Mm-hmm. We, I. Yes, it is. Do sp- spoilers really do work though? Right? They make your car c- c- faster. They make it cooler. Yeah, that's for sure. It, get, it helps you get pussy cooler. for yeah. sure. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. After you get a spoil on, you get a woman pregnant and you spoil her pussy. Mm-hmm. That's right. You Forever. take a shit. That's why I call rape whistles spoiler alerts. Because <laughs> you know. When I hear one, I think, damn, she's having sex with a guy that's got a really cool car. <laughs> <laughs> what that that lucky woman is That is true. Most getting the, have the hot chance to have sex with a cool, integra driving, you know, kind of yeah. guy. Oh yeah. Every car should have a spoiler. Why not? I agree. Yeah. Damn. Put her on a fucking get tourist. followed by a barbecue restaurant on yeah. Instagram. That's pretty You know, cool. it's funny. So it's funny because like, movie terms are the opposite of car terms, you know, where it's like you got a spoiler, car spoiler, pretty cool. Movie spoiler, not cool. Bad. What else? Movie trailer, awesome. Rules. Get, yeah, I love a I movie trailer. I don't know. <laughs> you have see the whole movie? 90 seconds. <laughs> a 90 second commercial for a movie. Yeah, you got a trailer on your car. my favorite thing. <laughs> Wow, what are you, homeless? Yeah, yeah. boo. Did you just get divorced? Fuck you, <laughs> you peasant. You fucking, fucking idiot. poor bitch. Nice U-Haul trailer. Yes. What are you doing, moving? <laughs> <laughs> fucking idiot. What are you, you moving got, or addicted to yeah. meth? Which yeah. one, bitch? <laughs> what, do you have you an Android phone? You had to move out of your apartment because everyone found out that you're an idiot? <laughs> <laughs> and was downloading child porn on the yeah. apartment Wi-Fi? <laughs> well, come on. Let's not go after Shane. He said... <laughs> We haven't mentioned him in a while. Hey, man, her. Oh, right. You fucking piece of shit. I guess. No, this is the year we take the pronouns back, dude. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm actually playing. I'm doing the the Take the Pronouns Back concert, benefit concert. <laughs> it's a Christian rock and Christian comedy benefit concert to hurt trans people. <laughs> take, take back the pronouns. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Dixie Chicks. <laughs> They're like, we're girls, not them. <laughs> <laughs> They're trying mm-hmm. to make up for their George W. Bush comments. Right. And mm-hmm. then there then there's a, a trans band called the Dixie Chicks. <laughs> <laughs> it's got the got the same name. Spelled a little different. That's good. Folks. That's really good. With a Y. You know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The Y at the end. Um, well, boys, fuck. We had an extensive show list of things to talk about. Yeah. How about uh this yeah. is a really good burrito. Yeah, the it's burrito really should good. go off. Bro. Should we do another business shout out so we can get some more Instagram? Honestly, yes. Shout, shout out to Lucha, out to Lucha, Lucha, Lucha. Lucha. They they go, they rock. They do dude. a hell of a burrito. Yo, get that breakfast it's, cherise. It is thirteen bucks. The breakfast burrito is amazing. Mm, it'll suck um, your cock off. Oh, I've never had the breakfast. Oh, burrito. it's I don't. so good. Yeah, the chorizo. Throw a couple eggs in there, some burrito. chorizo. Every time I go there, I feel like the menu is limited. But every burrito I've had there, yo, let me great. finish my burrito. Too. No, you finished it by putting it down. I didn't finish. I just didn't want to eat on mic because people get mad. Yeah, give it to me, Nick, so I can finish it. No. I'm hungry, though. Nick took first bite. That is rude as hell. Prima snack. Prima snack. Prima <laughs> <laughs> you come to my apartment with food, I'm taking the first bite of it. <laughs> I do love the concept of Prima snack this. Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck yeah, dude. Damn, I want some good snacks. God damn, that's a good burrito. It really fucking is. The problem, and I would go get one normally if this were my old life, mm-hmm. but not anymore, boys. Now I'm going home. Well, you're going to have a new life pretty soon, dude. Once that birthday rolls around, <laughs> me and Adam got a big surprise What are for you him. doing, mm-hmm. man? What is it? Oh, Tell you'll me. see. Just, uh... It's two different presents. It's two different presents, we'll but... but it's I don't one know, for me I don't and one for Nick. presents are correct are the term I would how about, use. How about this? Uh, think somewhere in between Dante's car. Okay. You know, and uh, a Pomeranian. Yo, are you guys going to get me a bulldog? No. That would rule. Is it a fur coat? It would be so cute if you had a bulldog yeah, that looked exactly kinda, like yeah, you. I know. Now I'm kind of mad we didn't get him a bulldog. Yeah, we should have got him a bulldog. <laughs> we can still change our minds. We can. Well, I can. You I got mean, yours, right? Yeah, I already, no, what the I already fuck? spent the money. 
Are you guys getting fat suits? No, no. we're not getting fat suits. It's actually suits. it is. We'll, we'll talk about it on the show. It okay, that they're both very thoughtful and also mean gifts. Yeah. <laughs> it's only the kind of gift real friends who want to hurt mm. your feelings could give you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> well, I can't wait to have a bulldog one day, dude. Just me yeah. and my fat ass bulldog. A little bulldog out. with a tracksuit on. Oh, yep. 100%. Wearing glass, mm-hmm. the same stock glasses. Maybe glasses, yeah. That'd I don't be know. Cute. That mm-hmm. would be cute. Yeah. Fuck, that would, it's going to be awesome. A lot of people look like their dogs, but I, I really don't look anything like my dog. No. My dog's muscular. Yeah. Yeah, you beautiful. Dog, you just, look like one of those birds that got caught in an oil spill. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. Yeah, like one Needs of those. Needs to be cleaned with a toothbrush. Exxon Mostly Valdez yeah. bird mm-hmm. ducks. Yeah. Get rubbed down by Dawn. I love how Dawn's always like, we're good, but we it's like, ducks. they definitely also yeah. make horrible chemicals, Yeah, you're a chemical right? company. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's S.C. Johnson, right? S.C. Johnson. Was it, that was the plot of Waterworld, is the bad guys live on the Valdez? The I don't smokers? Know. I've never seen Waterworld. The plot was that there was no more land. Oh, wait, There's is no Waterworld the one where the but guy But the has smokers gills? are the bad guys. That was like the gay... Uh, celebrity cause in the 90s was right. anti-smoking and also ending the death penalty. Yes. There are like a celebrity. That's not gay. That's cool. Uh, well, obviously you should end the death penalty, but anytime celebrities fucking get up their own ass about yeah, like, we're course. changing the world. Is that where Kevin Costner has gills? Yeah. Uh, and yeah. there's that fake ass Rob Oh, and... those are supposed to be gills. Yeah. What do you think they were? I thought it was he had pussies <laughs> on his neck. <laughs> neck yeah, pussies? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's The opening awesome. scene of that movie is that he drinks his own piss. Yeah, which is like... Nice. So ridiculous because it, you could obviously put seawater in that machine and have it do. Yeah, the yeah. why same do you have thing? to do with yeah. piss? It's just as salty. Yeah. Well, he's he just he wants to conserve, man. You know, yeah, zero guess, footprint. Yeah. Low fucker. <coughs> I kind of oh, liked that movie when it came out. Yeah, you're an idiot. <laughs> I was like nine years old, though. Yeah, you're stupid. It was I the most that movie expensive was movie of all time. At the, I think at we talked time. about it, but wasn't there a bootleg Robin Williams in there? There is. You know what's also weird is that movie has the same exact plot of as Mad Max Fury Road. Yeah. It's the There's in, not as many sexy bitches in it, It's though. the Fury Road is the inverse They're trying of to find world. water. Ah. This one, they're trying to find land. Yeah. I feel bad so for Fury the fat Road ladies. Came second, I guess they're copying. I feel bad for the fat ladies. In Fury, Fury Road, Road is amazing. I'm going to rules. I'm gonna fucking put on Fury Road again tonight. Yo, you know it's what I watched? Movie. You know what's so funny is I got that 4K Blu ray player, and Fury Road was the first thing I bought, and I watched it like nine times. I'm like, yeah, that's why you get DVDs. 100%. You watch them over again. I have not watched a single one of these DVDs yeah, yeah, the second yeah, yeah. time, oh, other course. than Fury Road. Fury Road goes off hard as shit. I got the projector back in the mix, and I bought an even better one, Dab. And uh, I'm ex- I was just watching Logan. Again, yeah, oh, yeah I got Logan. I might re- oh. actually I've re- rewatched Logan, Logan twice. Rocks, we got to take a break, off. and we'll be back in a second. Oh, yo, what's up, you motherfuckers? It's it's Stav and Adam. Yeah, stretching our legs here. We're the two sports fans We're on the, the sports podcast. Boys. And guess what, bitch? We got a nice motherfucking way for you to enjoy the Super Bowl with BetDSI.com. Mm-hmm. Adam, these motherfuckers have been in business for over twenty years, paying winners. Woo! Huh? Yeah. With a goddamn easy to use mobile playing interface, you fucking play, win, and get paid just like that off your phone. The same thing you beat off with. Uh, Bet DSI motherfucker has a great mobile app. You know, they offer live in game wagering throughout the game. You know what I mean? You get a little buffalo wing, you're like, let me fucking bang, let me bang the under on this while I'm, while I'm fucking doused in blue cheese. Me and Adam have been using it. We used it last week to bet on the Jags. Who what? What did they do? They covered. They fucking baby. covered, bitch. Shouts out to Bortles. Bortles mania. Now, did we lose on the Vikings? Yes, maybe we did. <laughs> um, but whatever, man. Use Bet DSI during the Super Bowl. Even if you don't like sports, you can bet on some like fun, goofy prop bets. Yeah, you know? they, and they got some doozies up on Bet DSI. This what do we week? got? Hit me with one of them. Okay, maybe. will a player leave a game and not return due to con- concussion symptoms? Uh, one hundo. We'll say yes. Let's say yes. Plus one twenty. That's not bad. Plus one twenty. Is that okay? That's and a, then, that's easy money. Easy money, bitch. Stav and I. Uh, Tom Brady announced retirement after the game. Must be no, shown on broadcast. He nope. won't. Uh, total number of Donald Trump tweets they have over under two point five. I'm gonna take I'm taking the, under. the under. Yeah, me too. He will congratulate the Patriots because they they are boys. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. so root against them. Any player take a knee during the national anthem? Probably not. That's the kind of shit we're talking about, baby. And we're probably gonna bang the Eagles just because we fuck with them. Let's go. Six. Yeah, uh, Eagles but, are getting six. 
Yeah. So enjoy, guys. Listen, bet use bet DSI during the Super Bowl, during all your gambling needs, and uh, check them out for sure. Fly Eagles, fly. And make sure when you go there, use promo code COME25 and get a free $25 wager on the house and a 200% extra Ooh. bonus on your deposit. Ooh. So COME25, free wager. Start winning today. Thanks, guys. And we're back. And we're back, bitch. Woo! We're back. We're uh, back Jimmy. on... What? Oh, you're, I thought you were doing your Jimmy I was Stewart. Doing, no, I was doing my James Dean. Uh. <laughs> I'm James Dean. You guys like that, James Dean? That's good, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is that for him from I'm hell? Rebel. That's what he sounds like now that yeah, he's he in sounds- hell. Oh, here I am, a sweet James Dean. <laughs> it's me, James Dean. <laughs> it's me, James Dean. Everybody loves me, sweet James Dean. <laughs> Everybody's favorite actor in the world <laughs> is me, <turning> James <laughs> Dean. <laughs> uh, hell yeah. You guys like Brando Cosby? Brando Cosby, <laughs> dude. Hell yeah. Yeah. I, was, I made him an offer he could refuse. <laughs> I, I made him an offer fat. he could refuse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we we drank a shit ton of liquid codeine. Oh yeah, we're on lean. Mm. Yeah. We're throwed, motherfucker. This is gonna be a shit, chopped dude? and screwed. I have episode. the lean. It's great. I love it. That dude. shit, it's fucking, I fucking awesome. Love it. I can't do it because uh, my Your friend dick is Frida, too small. Frida yeah. Santana just died. R.I.P. Fredo. Yeah. R.I.P. Brandon's bit about. Yeah. <laughs> nah, he'll do that for another. Oh, uh, he's gonna ride out three this or four day. years. Yeah. yeah. I would love to be addicted to liquid codeine. Yeah, dude, you can get there. DJ yeah. Screw died from you it, You will at some point. That It'll shift. Now you're an exercise boy. At a certain point, you'll get into something. You just get into things. And I feel right. like codeine, you will get into it. Do you get fat from uh, yes, lean? Yes, big yeah, time. Yeah, you get fat. Because mm-hmm. you're mm-hmm. always drinking it with scissor. You're always drinking it with Sprite mm-hmm. and John. Right, you're drinking sh- like sugar. Yeah. <laughs> Constantly. God, that's a great I'm drinking life. fucking McDonald's sweet and sour sauce and liquid codeine. Yes. I can't wait to be. They call that the good pussy juice, you know. <laughs> <laughs> we were saying that me and Stav had the theory that the pussy tastes better. If well, it's I don't know that it's me and you. Stav I think had it's this just idea. you, actually. You yeah. were doing this bit what off is mic. It? <laughs> <laughs> and then, wait, I want to hear that the non-consensual pussy's got a, <laughs> a, a sweeter flavor to the lips. You know what I'm saying? Oh, not really on the tongue. That's indecipherable. No, it was not me. Nice you know, try. You know the taste on the lips, like a clove cigarette. When, you, mm-hmm. when you're like, what? What is that? Yeah, the the forbidden the forbidden pussy's got yeah. a little sweet and sour sauce tinge to it. I only well, like conscious pussy. Thank you. Only pussy that listens conscious? to common. Yeah, 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 I was yeah, say, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Pussy wearing a backpack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and a daishiki. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Yeah. I'd, I'd fuck a pussy wearing a dashiki. I don't know what that would look was like. Was Dasha's name short for dashiki? <laughs> yes, it is. As a matter yep. of fact, it is. The na- the na- you In Russian culture, they name you after the hat the first guy who fucked you was wearing. Right. When you lost yeah. your virginity. I was saying for her yeah, acting that's why career. <laughs> her middle name is Kufi. <laughs> yeah. I was saying for her acting career, Dasha should um, start doing blackface and change her name to D apostrophe S-H-A. That's D- really good. Dasha? Yeah. Well, she might get a better... You know, that might not be good, though, because, you know, they're not paying people. Monique. Monique, yeah, I got... She's only getting 500 k from Netflix, or that was their offer? Yeah, they said they were a dollar a pound. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. I'm just sad we're gonna, to see... We're going to do it like the circus does. <laughs> 500000 is great. Well, not when fucking... Not know, when you're a star. Louis getting... Or whoever. Chappelle's getting, Chappelle what, 20 got, mil? I think 40 Amy million. got, like, yeah. fucking... Amy Schumer got what? Fifteen. Yeah, those mil? are both like huge celebrities. I know. Nobody knows. Monique remembers who the fuck is big. I'm with you. I'm Monique's, just saying. Monique's like on the same level as like Eddie Griffith. Yeah, superstars. She's a novelty. Superstars out of this yeah, world. No, superstars? nobody fucking gives a no, shit. No, I know what you're saying, but Monique. she's mad about them, I, and I'm just mad because you know, she's an anomalous of the Parkers, mm-hmm. which was one of my favorite UPN shows. I wanted to fuck her daughter, who fluctuated in weight a lot, and it so turns out it was a thyroid problem oh. that she had. I, I never that. fucked with that show. The Parkers? Mr. Ogilvy, right? He's like real gay or something, but she's trying to fuck him, I think. What was yeah. the one with Faison Love? What was that? Sh- fam- family something? What was the name of that one? I don't remember. Remember there was there was that 
Uh, fuck. Oh yeah, yeah. I uh, like that House show. of Pain. House of Pain. Oh, yeah. House Tyler of Pain. Perry's yeah. House of yeah. Pain. Yeah. They, would, a... they would shoot like eight in a day. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. They would... <laughs> that Wait, show no, was hold on, funny. hold on. I don't know if it was House of Pain. Fizz on Love might have been on that, but I'm thinking of a different show that was on in the '90s. Oh no, that's not House of Pain. No, House no, of Pain yeah, is that was 2000. That's yeah, T yeah, Pain's yeah. show. Yeah, no, I was thinking of some <laughs> show that was on in the '90s. Fuck, I'm gonna have to Let pull up my phone. Let me fuck your pussy. Do you remember the movie Major Pain? Yes, of course. Yeah, of course. That movie is a great movie. Yeah. Yeah. He's just abusing children, I think. Yeah, that's great. Damon Wayans. I love seeing kids, uh, you know. Yo, get back I was in watching the adult. Wayans Brothers show. I used uh, to love that shit show. Shit rules, dude. Yeah. It's so. We're brothers. Yeah. Uh, we're fine. Uh, the Parenthood. Mm-hmm. That was the name of the show. Parenthood. Oh, yeah. yeah, that was a good one. Yeah. Damn, he was on that show. That was yep. Phase on Love. Yeah, that oh, was. He was a, the uncle, right? Yeah. That was yeah. a great show. Wasn't that um, who was that guy? The uh, the black guy with the mustache. What the fuck is his name? Robert Townsend. Yes, Robert Townsend yeah. rules, dude. He was on the Young Comedian special, the Rodney Dangerfield one. That yeah. shit rocks. You guys should watch that shit. What did Phase on Love go to jail for recently? Uh, I'm gonna guess tax evasion. Yeah. Because every, uh, you know, guy mm-hmm. that makes money, no. mm-hmm. a lot of celebrities just forget that they have to pay taxes. The old Snipe, the old Wesley Snipes problem. Who else? I feel like somebody else did that. Love was born Langston Faison Santusima. Santusima? Santusima, yeah. That's a tight name, bro. Well, he's Cuban. That's tight. He is? He's an yeah. Afro-Latino? He's Afro-Cuban? Yeah. Well, wow. no, his dad was in the Navy. Oh. So he fucked a Cuban lady? Yeah. She came Guantanamo over a raft. What were they up to in Guantanamo before torture? You think it was like a chill, yeah, yeah, dude. chill zone? Yeah, they, like, they would read Hemingway. Eating Cubano, eating Cubano yeah, yeah, yeah. sandwiches? Yes, yeah, getting the pickles cigars. off because fuck pickles. Yeah. That's my take. Fuck pickles. Oh shit! You remember Don't what? Be a Menace? Yeah. Hell a, yeah! Don't yeah. Be a Menace. Such rocked. a funny movie. Yeah, and I I'm love gonna, that they have that party and it's like that slow pan and everyone's kind of like dancing and they're like grinding and then there's just two people fucking. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh uh, fuck! I love the Wayans Brothers. Yeah. <sighs> Well, good night, everybody. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, So we talked about Monique. Uh, What about Jeff Bezos? I don't know if we really did talk about. What about uh, Doctor Larry Nasser? If we found out that uh, Monique got paid less than Bill Cosby did for that bar show in Philly. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, I did fuck Monique from Baltimore. Salute. Was she? Yeah. Oh, good for her. Yep, me and her on the Mount Rushmore of Baltimore stand-up comedy. Me, her, Sonny Fuller. Tommy Simbazo. Tommy Simbazo. <laughs> Sonny Fuller's four. funny, though. Sonny Fuller's funny as shit. The rest of the comics that were named aren't, but... I fuck with Tommy, though. He's a good dude. No, I meant you and Monique. Oh, what? Yeah, but then also Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> Monique is funny, dude. Yeah. She does this whole thing about skinny bitches, and uh, it's just, I can't really res- describe it, but it's good. If I remember you're there. just seeing Sonny at a mic one time, and he's talking about some bitch whose hands smell like pennies. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, you know how fucking bad pennies smell? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sonny rules, bro. Yeah, yeah. I love the pictures he would put up on MySpace of just him selling yeah. crack. <laughs> like back in his selling crack days, mm-hmm. <laughs> allegedly. He had the, the no headshots, right? This. With the no, caution that's Tommy. Tape. That's Tom. we've talked about that. Tommy Tommy's did. got the yeah, caution, yeah. but shout out to Tommy. He's funny. He fucks. He's over in uh, he's over in uh, Dubai doing shows for the Prince. Um, for the Dubai, prince? more Not like bye bye. Yeah, for the Prince. More like bye <laughs> bye. Uh, I don't know. Right. They're doing like a murder mystery show overseas for the troops. Whoa. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> what's a murder mystery series? They kill a troop. Know. Yeah, they kill. They cover up a sexual assault. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> How much better would a Full Metal Jacket have been if they all had sex with Pyle in his bunk that would instead be, of just beating him with soap? It would be soap. a much better That's movie. all it takes is you get beat with soap one time and you got to kill yourself. Well, he was clearly a bitch. Well, you kill yeah. the you kill the the drill drill sergeant and then yourself. God damn it, Pyle! Can't you at least get sexually assaulted first? <laughs> Let the boys bust a couple nuts. Wait. What is the steers and queers from Full Metal Jacket or is it from another movie? I've had this argument before. I don't know, man. Yeah. I've never only, seen Full Metal only Jacket. Only two things come out of Oklahoma: Steers and Queers. Yeah, that's a classic. Is that is that Full Metal Jacket? I believe so, but I don't know. I've said that because I guess it is. Is it someone else? Oh, I forget. Whatever. Never mind. 
Um, that was my contribution. Nice man. Uh, that movie is weird because it's like two different movies. That's pretty. If cool. If you could be gay or a bull, which yeah, it's like pick? that. It's like that Queen song. Uh, what? What? You know, the, like we will rock you, fat bottom girls. No, and then fat bottom. We boys? are the champions. Yep. But mm-hmm. the beginning is. Mm-hmm. There's two different songs and they always just play them back to back. Danny's like my penis, lick my butt. Bohemian Rhapsody. No, a lot of different songs. Not Bohemian Rhapsody. You got come on your face. I fucked, your, I fucked your mother named Grace. That's also a song about Adam. Sucking your penis all you over the place. I fucked a woman we? named Grace? <laughs> yeah. He's can you imagine having sex with a woman named Grace? Yeah, I can. That'd be terrible. I think it'd be cool, actually. I don't think so. She uh, just doesn't take her big... Pearl necklace yes, off the whole dude. time. She's got a frilly ass collar on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I had sex with a woman named Grace. Really? Yeah. A what, Chinese Grace? Was, yeah, well, she yeah. had like a Chinese. What that name. pussy or, like? Yeah, so her real Korean name was name. like. Yeah. Chin, wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she had a Korean name, yeah, but yeah. Grace was her English. Is that half, half the Asian names are just the Doppler effect. Yeah, we name. We name our daughter after standing outside the highway waiting to get picked up by pickup truck <laughs> to be brought to factory. We hitchhike from field where our daughter was born. Yo, you know and they named her after sound of 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 bus go by. <laughs> you know, like uh, co- like Chinese restaurant cooks, like they all like get bust over to random ass fucking. Yeah, I, I, mm-hmm. I told you this. No, nah, I listened to an NPR story about well, it. Well, I told you it after living with... Well, with I forgot about your dumbass boring story. And my I fucking good from story NPR. about no, being I the was, Jane clearly Goodall wasn't memorable of the enough. Chinese. <laughs> clearly wasn't memorable <laughs> enough. <laughs> That's true. Listen, I'm not taking anything away from your ethnographic work. <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> dude, I was on safari for years. <laughs> <laughs> you were in the bamboo safari, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just wearing a fucking pith helmet. <laughs> no, you're wearing one of those. And how was your... Your day, ping pong. <laughs> They're like, please stop talking. I'm Eric. Like that. My name is yeah. Eric. My name is Dan Nguyen. I'm a financial advisor at Chase Manhattan. Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck. Here's a here's a conversation that I was mm-hmm. having with my friend Pete, mm-hmm. uh, who just moved in. Shouts out to Petey, PDZ, me, Pete, Eldis, Ryan, holding it down. Um, uh, if you had to rank the types of Asian cuisines. Yes. What you know? We got Chinese, Vietnamese, mm-hmm. Japanese, Korean. Those are East Asian. Do you throw in Indian food? Oh, or interesting. Thai food? Thai, obviously. Thai I guess Southeast. Indian. I guess Indian. Yeah. Ooh, that's that's interesting. That's a little wild. You card. gotta mix it up, dude. Where? What's your ranking? I go at the top. Top. Japanese. Japanese, because they got sushi and they got fucking ramen. Yeah, and they have like yakitori. Yakiniku. Yeah, Which is bootleg Korean barbecue. All right, let's not get too racist on the show. <laughs> That's the real word for <laughs> it, dude. <laughs> Yaki- no, <laughs> Yaki- Niku. I know these are all fake Yaki- words. Niku, dude. Yeah, Don't I make mean, fun of their culture that I much. Actually, for, for uh, <laughs> Christmas, I got a... Uh, the Morimoto uh, Morimoto Sakushaki Yeah cookbook. That's why you're so desperate To say all these words You literally just learned <laughs> I didn't say he said it No I know Yakiniku bitch Cause that's 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 a Japanese Korean barbecue Yeah So I learned it When I was over there Damn We should go to K-Town tonight And get a little barbecue I'm not going tonight K-Town sucks In Manhattan I think it's cool in Flushing I'll go to Flushing uh, That's what That's interesting tonight. Cause that's what they say about you Adam mm-hmm. That I'm cool in you Flushing You suck in Manhattan No that you suck <laughs> And people flush have been yeah. flushing their penis using your ass like a yeah. toilet, and flushing their cum down. That's it. why they call it flushing queens. <laughs> yeah. Cause it's yeah. where the it's the headquarters of Kohler. That's right. Um, that's a that's a, a, a that German toilet company. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, nice. <coughs> uh, also, fuck. Uh, Yo, shout out to Germany. Yeah, they did yeah. some cool stuff historically speaking. I kind of want to go to Berlin. Nah, fuck Germany. I'm not going there. Fucking schnitzel. I, I said no. I want to go to Berlin. I know. I'm saying fuck that. Yeah, stop. Won't let you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can't go. I'm not going. To go stop. I want to <laughs> go to Berlin too. Apparently, it's really tight. Yeah, you, let's go to Berlin. Apparently, it's, it's pretty cheap still. Yeah, it's cheap, and then also people fuck there. That's why Stav doesn't want to oh, go. Oh wait, because he's not. There's, there's not a, a guy. Fucking he's not a drugs. guy like us that has sex. Yeah. I'm sex. First of all, I'm sex Stavros. You're not sex. We should go to the sex Stavros. We should go to that techno club. 
No, we're not going to the I'm, Bergheim. I'm dark or Nick We're going to go to Bergheim. Dark Nick. Yeah, dude, I'm Nega Nick. <laughs> what, what was that? What? Nega Nick? <laughs> like Nega Duck. Nice. Oh. That's Nega fun. Duck, who's Dark Wing Ducks. I remember. Yeah. I know. I the just want you to say it again. Of Dark Wing Duck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, what, they what really, they like? really got close with that. Yo, one. they really did. <laughs> wow, <laughs> I didn't. They even were on that tightrope. That. That's like when people are like, "Actually, this children's show has a lot of jokes for adults." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of them for a very specific kind of adult. Yeah, like like Pick Winnie the Pooh. S- Storm. I just got a friend named Tigger. That's a joke for adults. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> children don't get that one, but <laughs> us adults, we sure as shit get that one. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good bit for uh that's a hack black comics bit. Uh the one he jumps the most, you know, he's like the most athletic, mm-hmm. yeah. et cetera. Extra bone. Mm-hmm. I always was confused. I always saw Tony the Tiger and the Exxon Tiger were the same guy. Whoa. Whoa. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. I they forgot. did used to have a bootleg ass I Tony the Tiger. Oh, yeah. holy shit. Because people were complaining about this. I posted that picture of Tony the Tiger fucking another yes. tiger. Mm-hmm. And they were like, well, isn't his dick tip blue? And it's like, it's first of all, in the ass. it's in the ass. So shut the fuck up. Mm-hmm. You know, check. Don't come at me on Instagram with these b- bullshit mm-hmm. queries. Uh, but on top of that, I'll venture to say, anytime you see Tony the Tiger without a blue dick tip on DeviantArt, you're actually looking at the Exxon Tiger. Oh, that's how you tell the difference. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Wait, did the Exxon Tiger have no blue, nothing blue about uh, it? I, I, think I don't he think he had you a yellow the penis. Interesting. <laughs> interesting. I don't think the penis you, was probably yeah. <laughs> featured. <laughs> But you could <laughs> soft ass dick telling you to buy gas. <laughs> just gotta live you could write maybe. Yeah, yeah. Is this, what's is this the to go mart? <laughs> you could write a letter to the CEO of Exxon. Of Mobile. Exxon Valdez. Yeah. Dear CEO of Exxon Mobil. Mm-hmm. Oh, my shit. name is Stablos. How? <laughs> Look how much more jacked he is. The Exxon Tiger. Oh fuck. He, he seems more he's badass. A, he's a fucking daddy. But he was like the he was the mini mart logo, right? He wasn't like the the gas logo. He was like the shopping part. Logo. The shopping, yeah, but all, also remember the old, there was Exxon's where the pumps had pump covers that were like tiger tigers. Tail, yeah, tiger but they tails. were real tigers though. Yeah, yeah, they, those were taxidermy tiger tails. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're illegal from Africa. Oh fuck yeah, he's an interesting tiger. He has more stripes than Tony for sure. He doesn't have the scarf. He would probably top Tony. the bandana. What if do you I had to it? guess, he would top Tony. Don't talk shit on Tony. I think Exxon. Oh man, the first thing is Exxon Tiger versus Tony the Tiger. Oh fuck, here's one of them kissing. Nice. Thank you, Internet. Yeah, his nose is his nose is like pink. So you probably got a pink his, dick. his dick is normal. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's a picture. Of I, that's what I said, man. Yeah, he's more orange than Tony. Tony's a little yellower. But there's none yeah. of them fucking, unfortunately. Well, if any of the fans want to get on that for us, I think for sure uh, Tony would get would bottom. Oh Why? yeah, because the scarf. Well, he's the Exxon Tiger, he, you know, he's been out on the oil rigs exactly. for months. So Tony's, Tony's fucking just fucking around cereal. with cereal and taking care of the children. You know how much rougher his hands are? <laughs> the the Exxon Mobil guy? He's been lifting shit. Right. Although maybe he goes the other way and he wants to get fucked. Man, take his mind off the The funniest the uh, gay deviant porn is the one that's drawn in pencil on paper. And yes, scanned, scanned in. Yeah. Yeah, at like, the public library. <laughs> imagine you're a man with like a fucking, you know, your home business, and your son's like, Dad, can I use the, can I use the scanner in your office? <laughs> like, I, I don't know, Michael. What do you need to use the scanner for? <laughs> I just, I do need to use it for, for something. If I could use it, please. What's the most predominant one? Is it Sonic and Tails? Mm, yeah, yeah, I would say so. I just need to upload another one of my Sonic drawings. There's got to be a drawing where all of Tails' tails are dicks, right? Yeah, yeah, John. Yeah, it's Michael. I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna have to put you on hold for a minute here. My my son needs to use the scanner <laughs> in my office, and I don't. I just. I don't. I, I don't need to leave the room, but I don't want to be in here with <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'll call you back in 15 minutes. No, it's the younger one. No, the older one's, he's varsity. He's fine. Yeah. The older one is normal. <laughs> I had to buy condoms for him last week. It's just, it's the younger one. Yeah, I think my, I think my wife tried to douche out that load with Lysol. <laughs> and it got... <laughs> 
<laughs> he's hating the Lysol? It yeah. bleached them. She tried to, it bleached the cum. <laughs> and that's why he's like this. <laughs> <laughs> we can't buy, we can't buy regular cereal anymore. <laughs> because he'll start coming to the mask. <laughs> We found a drawing of the Lucky Charms guy, and he had a cock ring with all of the different <laughs> charms on it <laughs> in his room. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh. okay. No, I'll call you back in five minutes. He's just going to use the scanner. <laughs> Thank you, Dad, for letting me use the scanner. I'll, I'll, I'll be quick to use the scanner. It's, it's a drawing I made for my friend online. Yeah, that's great that you have you have friends now, buddy. So just uh, make sure to wash your hands before you touch any of the buttons. <laughs> Thanks. Hell yeah, dude. That's a fun little sketch. That's a fun guy. Yeah. Oh, man. I can't wait to have a, a son, a firstborn masculine child. Yeah. Your cum definitely only produces retard. No way. Oh, yeah, dude. You're going to have the sure. most fucked up kids. I have kid. think the most retarded cum. kids ever. Yeah. No way, dude. You're, you're going to have fucked gonna, up nah. inbred Jew cum. No, I'm just going to have gay. Stav's going to have some like extremely wheelchaired kid that fucking Absolutely hooked not. up to machines that beep Absolutely all the time. Absolutely not. One of those St. Like, Jude's kids. Is it just me or do a lot of comics have retarded kids? I think like just... A couple, but okay, they really mind. stand out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never mind. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, nah, yeah, dude. my son is going to be so gay. It's going to be so annoying. Yeah. Well, I, c- I have beautiful genetic stock. I'm going to be fine. A lot of gen- genetic variants. D- fucking Mullen's basically all inbred Irish bullshit. You're, mm-hmm. you're all fucked up Jew. You yeah, know? Nick's son's gonna be born drunk. <laughs> yeah, he will. He's gonna be have sure. FAS, and his mom won't even drink. The entire time. He gave himself FAS. <laughs> 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 He's drinking <laughs> just for leftover in your jizz <laughs> from years of alcoholism. Yeah, <laughs> that whiskey soaked fucking load. Yeah. No, I'll probably never have kids. I'm gonna die alone. Yeah, miserable. for sure. You should never have. Dasha kids. was That'll telling me she really terrible. wants a gay kid, and she's like, "Yeah, I'm gonna like." take baths with him and stuff just so yeah. like he's not attracted to women at that's all that's hilarious yeah I was like oh. that is gonna just be a really fucked up straight guy Daddy. he's gonna get eldest basically yeah <laughs> <laughs> my mom no, took baths with me till I was 18 it's gonna be a guy that kills women yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's not how you make gay people I don't know yeah, she's going to expose She's going to bring her friends over to show them their yucky pussies <laughs> at 13. <laughs> Look at this picture. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Is it a guy sucking off Tony? No, no it's <laughs> just a fucking it's a fat guy. It's a fat guy that's selling like a an Exxon statue that he collected. Yeah, uh, a yeah. nine foot tall <laughs> Esso <laughs> Tiger. But just look at this guy's body. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Yeah. <laughs> my man looking like an off-season mall Santa Claus. You know my guy's got the best workshop. Bro. What's oh, this yeah. fam look like a snack thing that people keep saying? I oh, no it's idea. just saying that someone looks cute. It's like they look like what? a snack. Yeah. That's old. I, aren't they making fun of people used to say shit like that? Is yeah, it ironic it's a, again? It's just a, now it's people are doing it ironically. Yeah. But yeah, it's just to say someone's cute. Yeah, if someone looks like a snack. Looking yes. like an MF snack. Yes, of course, yeah. for sure. I'm always looking like a damn snack. I always look like the fucking, the little glass shelves underneath, like I'm at the movie theater next to the fucking. You're looking like a, a box of milk duds. I'm looking like a fucking, some Twizzler. I got a Twizzler for you, bitch. Hey, Sav, I got a question. Are you are you pita, uh, pita chips and hummus? Pito chips. Huh? Are you pita chips? Adam eating pita, pita chips, chips again? Hummus, yeah, because you're you're looking like a snack. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> that's good. Are you baby carrots? Yes. And ranch dressing. Mm-hmm. That's your dick and ranch dressing. Because you're you're looking like a snack. Thanks, man. Yeah. Thanks for noticing. I have been working out three days in a row. So have you? I'm pretty fucking. Jacked. Oh yeah, the guy that booked me on the Israel show is like. Um, he's like, do you know how often stuff goes to uh, Planet Fitness Astoria? <laughs> I'm oh like, why? no. He's like, because I've seen him there like once, but I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm there all the time. I just, it's different. It's weird hours. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. have a schedule, Off but hours, I'm there a yeah. lot. Probably when he's at work, right? Probably when you're at work, yeah. you know, brainwashing fucking children. No, he's against, chill, dude. He's chill. Against His politics are good. Shout out good. to, shout out to my guy. Whatever, but, man. But, uh, yeah. They I'm put trying a to be lot on Greek of, TV speaking now. Speaking of looking like a snack, they put a. 
about it. Yeah, you were looking four like four inches of you makeup. You were looking on like me. Liberace, dude. I looked, I looked pretty <laughs> ridiculous. You look like a fucking weatherman. This Spanish lady did my makeup, and she did give me a couple of great compliments. Too. Like what? She's like, I just want to tell you, you have incredible eyebrows. And I was really? like, wow, I didn't even know that's something. That's nice. You could have. I guess good they're, they're pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And then afterwards, she's like. I'm like, all right, goodbye. And she's like, no, no, no. You you don't want me to take your makeup off. I was like ready to walk out the studio looking like <laughs> <laughs> fucking <laughs> psycho. Did you kiss her? No, but she did kind of put her boobs in my face a Ooh. couple times when she was doing my makeup. I love that. And I think it was deliberate, yeah. 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 You should have fucked her, dude. She was being real nice. No, yeah. I couldn't do it, dude. I'm going to commit a relationship. Were you hard? Did she put her boobs in your face? Be honest. No, but I yeah, actually I did get kind of a little ASMR y kind of shit. It's like in a very similar way to uh getting your hair shit. Getting shampoo. your ass fucked. Yeah, and your ass fucked. <laughs> very similar way. I don't know what it is about getting my ass <laughs> fucked, but every time I do it I get ASMR it sets tingles. Up my ASMR. It yeah. tingles in that and my fucking I get prostate. Just, uh spinal ASMR tingles every every time I <laughs> And when I get my back blowed out. Every time I just uh <laughs> Just a big <coughs> giant. Nick, does that happen cock. to you when you get fucked in the ass? Uh, no, sorry, I'm responding to Instagram DMs. <laughs> Come on, dude. <laughs> Come on, dude. This is part of the show, dude. What did you say? Uh, Are you ignoring it? No, not me ignoring it. But I mean, we we have a responsibility you were to the doing fans. Good. That was a good ASMR little. Uh, I wanted. That's why I wanted sec. to ask Nick if he ever did that. What does ASMR him? stand for? Uh, extremely mentally Ooh. retarded. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's why we needed you in there, bud. Yeah. All right. Well, if you'll excuse me, I'll be back to my DMs. <laughs> All right. I'll tell you. I'll see you later. Um. Oh fuck, dude. I took these fucked up pills, like these fucked up. What kind of pills? Off, over Boner? the internet, no, over the internet, like Indian Adderall, that uh, why why a homie gave that? me, and I feel fucking fucked up and weird right now. Yeah, you shouldn't be doing that. I don't. It doesn't even. It hasn't made me feel alert. I just I feel weird. Like you're on meth or something? Not really. It's like just, methy? I have like a weird feeling going on. I don't feel good. It makes you feel like sick. I have kind of a headache. Queasy. Not even queasy. I don't know exactly how to describe it. It's Just like off. right before Adderall would kick in, the feeling. Uh-huh. Like I'm kind of on edge, but I'm not focusing it's on like anything. nervous. Man, I really want to sm- uh, get high this week now that I have the apartment yeah, to myself. Yeah, you told me you were going to buy... Uh, I didn't see that guy. The guy Are we going to have a weed party? No, I just... I, I like call my weed guy right now. I like smoking weed alone. Damn, bro. Yeah, dude, what a fucking asshole. Fucking Did you loser. hear that? Yeah, he sucks. Nick? Jesus Why Christ. don't we do a fucking get fucking stoned app this weekend? No, nah, that'll be terrible. We get high as shit. No, I did a couple of I did a couple of episodes when I had smoked beforehand. Yeah. Remember that? I had that little weed week. That was, that was Andre's fun. Steakhouse, man. Oh, it was, yeah. Bro, dude, let's get weed fucking is good for you. Listen, Nick. how about this? Yeah, but I have to be alone. No, you don't. No, yes, you don't. I do, dude. It's like Mozart. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're going You're through a powdered notes wig. And we're like, it's perfect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no mistakes. It's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I never knew someone could say slurs so flawlessly. Yeah. A deaf Tony the Tiger named Noni the Niger. <laughs> there you go, dude. Yeah, dude. That's you just, just gotta you just gotta just, tap into the weed mindset. That's just yes. you thinking about weed. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> How about this? You'll yeah. get regular high. I love Noni the Niger. I'll People get like, excuse me. Uh, He's you know, deaf. from Foster Flakes. <laughs> I'll take an edible. I'll get insanely fucked up. I hate those shits, dude. They're terrible. It'll be funny. And you'll be the only sober one, Adam. I, I can now have like two hits. I've worked my way back up. You would be two. great is, is like if they made headables where it's like mm-hmm. weed that's inside of a girl's brain and when she sucks your dick, it gets you high. That yeah. would be awesome. So be the, cool. the downside would be that it would kill the woman to yeah. do the surgery to do that to her. But okay. I'm willing to uh, allow that to happen. Wait, it would kill her before you got Because your no, penis no, no, no. has to touch her brain. So they replace her brain with weed and then she <laughs> okay. sucks your dick and when you come, it creates a vacuum that sucks the weed into your dick uh. and then that rips out her spine and she experiences horrific pain. Wow. And it kills her. Mm-hmm. But that doesn't, you get hmm. I, but I think the British are coming, dude. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and that's that's a real bong hit train. Okay, well what if that was the only way you could smoke weed, would you? Of course. All right. I know Adam would. Yeah, he doesn't care about women. He doesn't care about women. I wouldn't Me, I, I care about women. women up until it's convenient for me to not care about women. I care all the time. Do you? you, you mm-hmm. He stop cares too much. You know, I care you're too asleep? much. 
Even when I'm asleep, I, I care about women while they're asleep. I care about women in business, you know. <laughs> yes. Let's make deals, ladies. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's let's exclude people. Let's. I like women are better at business because they're cattier and spiteful. Yep. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's like that's like what makes business fun. Yeah. It's fucking people over yeah. and talking yeah, shit about calling them someone the back. poor behind his back. <laughs> 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 yeah. Making fun would, of the guy who sends his child to public school. Right. Why would you want a fucking Indian CEO who goes on stage wearing sandals? Mm, you know yeah. yeah Fuck that shit I know Give me a bitch Give me a, give me a mean girl yeah, And the in the in the it's words of Mike book. Tyson Like a powerful type of bitch Like the president of a CEO company <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite part of that documentary Yeah actually it's my favorite part of that documentary And you only liked it after I said it <laughs> That's not true <laughs> Shut up Oh fuck <laughs> That part is so funny What oh, are you no. talking about Like the president of a the CEO fuck? company yeah. I got tenacity I'm ferocious yeah, yeah, I love that. He's a good, he's a good guy. Definitely, not a yeah. Rapist. I mean, he he raped at the right time, I guess, socially. Yeah, yeah and he's not sorry about it or anything, right? He That's says, what that Taylor Swift album is about, right? <laughs> it's about <laughs> Mike Tyson and Robin <laughs> Givens. Was that 1989? I think it was in the no, 90s. It was in the 90s. 89 was when he when he lost to uh, Buster Douglas. Then what? 92? Is that 89? Because it was my birthday. The day when I was you were born, born mm-hmm. was the day Tyson 11th. lost. Yep. Damn. Mm-hmm. I very, I very vividly. I remember there. I was there. My mom gave birth at the fight. That's why I remember. At the fight mm-hmm. on the mat. Yep. In mm-hmm. the ring. That's like, why he lost. Yep. And as soon as Stav's parents lost all the money they brought over from Greece betting on that fight. <laughs> yep, it's true. Yeah. They lost all their drachmas all their at that drachmas. fight. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I guess Adam knows what the the money is called in Greece. Interesting. Looks like a little dictionary boy got um, his last actually, tidbit in right at the end of the episode. <laughs> actually, that's not what the money is called in Greece. The money is called the euro. Originally, though, it was called drachma. Thank you. Drachma. All right, and that's the end of the episode. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Everyone listen to the fucking uh, Patreon if you don't already. Uh, we do double the damn motherfucking episodes. Oh, yeah. We got a website now, too. That's, do we? I guess sort of launched, but no, I, what, what I'm going to no, do is... it hasn't is, launched yet. Like, Okay, well, uh, yeah, I, we should probably plug that at the beginning rather than the yeah. end. But then, a lot of people, I guess I don't know why we didn't think to do that, but there's two episodes every week. If you like the show, uh, you don't, you want another episode. What? Uh, I haven't confirmed it yet. Okay. But, uh, no, there's uh, 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 fucking shit. <laughs> God damn it Why'd you have to ask me that question Sorry right? dude I was just wondering Patreon There's two episodes a fucking week right. One you is free to... And one is paid with And the you $5 can't We're not searchable on Patreon Because it's adult content So you gotta go Either go to Google And type in Cometown Patreon Or go to Patreon.com Slash Cometown You can subscribe It gives you a personalized RSS link You add that to Whatever podcast player you use And then you get The additional episode a week We also have like Video content That goes up on there And then we are going to be launching a website soon where subscribers will have like added you know perks as far as well that depends on like what i can figure out with uh but right now just for right are. now right, we right got for now yeah, yeah free yeah. A, double the apps and a whole fucking backlog so mm-hmm. if you're if you want more come yeah, subscribe yeah, to yeah the about, there's like 70 episodes on there yeah uh all right thanks guys 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 all right, thanks guys. All right.